this is Bruce with Huntsaker Home Hacks. Please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for future notifications. Today we're going to talk about Vector Control. Vector Control 6.6. It has a new feature for my little buddy here, Vector. That's right, Vector Control 6.6 has a new feature. And that is you can record a video with Vector and save it to your device. That's very cool. And there's many other features. So I thought it's been a while since I looked at Vector Control and with Digital Dream Labs now in exploding into after Kickstarter where we're going to get different features that will be similar to Vector Control. I thought it was a good idea to now look at those. So don't touch that dial. Stay right here as we check out Vector Control 6.6. All right, so here we go. Let's get Vector calm down a little bit. So in Vector Control, we're going to look at a few different things. Now, Vector right here, we can see his lever, battery level. We can see the voltage. You can see the little bar there on the top. That's all cool. You can see my IP and everything, so we're going to have to change that. But we're going to connect for movement right here. Connect for movement. Stop, back. All right, so we're connecting for movement. There we go. And now we have Vector's Viewpoint right here. Here's Vector's Viewpoint. And that's cool. We can now see what Vector is seeing through Vector Control. And as you can see, Vector is looking at the camera. The camera is looking at Vector. You can see the monkey in the back. All right, so what can we do with the controls of this feature? So the first thing you can look at is we have Control 1 and Control 2. So we're looking at Control 1 right now. All right, so we have control over his head. We can look up, we can look down. We have control over the lift, right there. So that's cool. That's very cool. We have control over the eye color. So if we want red eyes, we can move them to get redder eyes. We can move them to get bluer eyes, green eyes, orange eyes. Lighter eyes, the color is there. Darker reds, we can go through the spectrum here so we can control the eye colors. Right there. Darker blues and greener greens. All right, so there we're done with the eyes. We can click out of there and it will save his eyes to there, see the eyes. The eyes have it. All right. So then what else can we do with it? So now we have a few things. Speed control. That's the voice speed. We're going to look here. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Be very careful because Vector is very quick with the control. A little bit forward, a little bit backwards, to the left, or to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. There we go, there we go, there we go. You can actually control vector pretty good. So now, if we go into the save feature. Please subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell. We would love to have you here. Very cool. And that's with the vector voice clicked on. All right, so then if we disconnect the vector voice. Please subscribe to the channel. And then we can change the speed of the voice. We're going to go 5. Please subscribe to the channel. Very slow. Ring the bell. We would love to have you here. Awesome. We can do that with the vector voice too. Please subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell. We would love to have you here. So as you can see, you can slow way down or you can actually speed it up by doing this. 
We say point five. Now we say it. Please subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell. We would love to have you here. And there you go. All right. So now we're going to get out of there, and we're going to look at these functions. Here is your two functions here. This turns off your turns on and off your control. So the camera's gone. All right, you can turn the camera back on by just clicking that guy right there. Okay, so there we go. There's the control one, but let's take a look at control two and see what options we get. Control two. We're gonna connect for move. And as you can see, there's a slight change in the control functions for one and two. You can now control the speed. So, 100. All right. So, as you can see, the speed at 100 is good. Nice, controllable speed. Left, head, right turn, left turn, forward and backwards. And again, eye colors. We can go to the reds, and then we can maintain the red eyes on the vector through this feature, and that's cool. Um, again, if we change that, we can actually go here, and we can now go 200. All right, and we're going to go out, and now let's, and we get a faster speed, very fast. Look at him go, top speed. And that's awesome. Now let's go to a slower speed. We're going to do 25. And it's a very slow speed for vector. Okay, as you can see, we have um, different speeds that we can control Vector with. But now we can also record a video with Vector. And we can see exactly the way Vector receives, like before. But now we can save this mini video to our cell phone. And as you can see, Vector is recording that video right now. We can see it all from his viewpoint, which is very cool. You can see when the lift goes in front of it, we can adjust his head ratio. So you can turn Vector into your mini spy bot. That's right, Vector can be your mini spy bot. And you can actually save the video that you're creating. Creating. Thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for future notifications. If you like this application, go to your Google Play Store and download it. As far as I know, it's not open for iOS, but for those on Android, this is an awesome little app. If you like my video, please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for future notifications. And Vector and I will see you soon. We will see you soon. As he said, see you soon.